Hey beauties, it's Kenya. I'm coming to share some details on this big hair that I'm wearing. So if you wanna hear the details on this big hair, then just keep watching. So this is a four x four closure unit. The closure piece is 20 inches and the rest of the hair of the bundles are 24 inches. And this unit can be found on kbsgoldenhairfetish.com under the name Tamara. So this is the Tamara unit. So what I did before I applied the wig was I washed it with conditioner, Tresemme hydrating conditioner, and then I let it air dry overnight. So um, this is this here has been air dried and now I'm just applying water from the spray bottle. I'm going to apply product later, but right now I'm just applying water just to help me to comb through the hair easier. So this unit also comes in other lengths. You can get it in a 14 inch, 18 inch and a 20 inch and all that information is on the website the prices for each length so the knots are bleached there are combs in this unit there's a band on the unit and I didn't use any glue or hairspray to keep this unit down it's literal literally like a glueless unit you can just put it on and go take it off at night and that's what I love about closure units. You can just take them off or put them on so quick and easy. So if you were going somewhere where it's gonna be hot, like maybe the beach or to a party or some kind of event, you might wanna glue it down a little bit. I don't, I don't trust the glueless methods that much, but for everyday use for just like going to work or to like the mall or whatever, I don't think you need glue for all that where you're just gonna be still or sitting and just whatever. Yeah, I don't think you need glue or hairspray for that. But also just know that kinky curly hair requires um, more work that you would, than you would put into like straight hair or wavy hair. This type of hair is like dealing with natural hair, how you would care for your own natural hair. You need to water your hair, you need to add product, keep your hair moisturized, and this unit, this type of hair, whether it's bundles, clip-ins, you need to care for it the same way so it doesn't mat up or knot up on you, but if you take care of this hair, this hair can last you at least a year or more if you're really good at taking care of your hair. And the product I used on the hair after wetting it was the Ion Keratin Smoothing Foam that I got from my local Sally's beauty supply store. And yeah, it works pretty good. I had to use quite a bit of it, but it got the job done. I didn't want to use any gels or any other heavy products in it that were full, like filled with oils or whatever. I just wanted to use something lightweight. And yeah, so this product really helped to define the curls in this unit. As you can see, the curls are starting to pop and they are eventually gonna just pop, pop yeah so yeah that product works pretty good for me anyway um, and it's easy to comb through and when you re-wet the hair with your spray bottle you should be able to comb through it still just the same so as you can see the curls look great and off camera I did cut the lace and did a bit of plucking around the hair the hairline but yeah the curls look awesome and that's yeah that's the product i used so with this closure unit or any closure unit i guess you can move the part from side to side, wherever you want it, a deep side part or a middle part, wherever you want it, or you can just actually part on the lace. If you want the middle part, you can just part down the middle. And I think I do just use a middle part on this unit. And that's pretty much it. I feel like I talked for hours. But yeah, if I left anything out, if you want more information, feel free to ask me a question in the comment section. And I'll always leave information in the description box. So I'll leave a link to the website in there as well. But yeah, I just want to thank you all for watching, liking, and subscribing to this video. Hope you all enjoy the rest of your evening and maybe, you know, even the rest of 2020, the way it's been going. We still need to stay positive and, you know, hope for the best. 
But yeah, thank you all for watching. And any questions, just ask me in the just ask me in the comment section. And yeah, until next time.